Welcome to Asbury Hall Golf Club. I'm Piers Ward. And I'm Andy Proudman, and today we're answering a Facebook question on chipping. Welcome to me and my golf TV. So today's question's from Anthony Darcy through Facebook, and Anthony's saying that he's struggling with his chipping, getting the thin shots that sort of go straight across the green, or the club slides underneath the ball and the ball's barely travelling, Piers. This is common... Common thing you see with the chip day, there. unfortunately. So what we, wanted, what we wanted to do with this video is we sort of go through the common mistakes that everyone tends to make with the chipping and then give you some simple things in the setup and golf swing to think about really, really quickly. Okay, so Pierce, let's go through some of the, what we see people have been told to do with the chipping. Um, okay. Just in the setup point of view, the setup's crucial really making, you know, for, for you having a consistent solid contact. So if you take your setup, Pierce, just from a neutral position here. Okay, let's so go this is how I would chip. This is how yeah. Pierce would start, but okay. then we're going to change it for what you guys are doing. So one of the things that we get told to do is let's put the ball back in the stance. So let's get the ball sort of to the right foot. That's the first thing a lot of people, are, mistakes that a lot of people are making. Then we get told to lean the shaft forward. Okay? Okay. Good. And then we get told to lean the weight on the left leg. And then we get told to open the stance. Now, when we take a look at this setup now, uh, one of the words that we always t like to use, Pierce, is neutral. Yeah. Okay, now this doesn't look anywhere near neutral no, here. I'm all over the place. <laughs> so we can see a sure. couple of things. The shaft's sort of very much forward, the ball's back in the stance, the head's not quite aligned, shoulders are tilted, the right shoulder's are sort of much lower. Now, to make a solid, consistent contact from here makes it very, very difficult. Good luck. Now, just to show the problem, you can relax there, Pierce, a second. The problem with your the thin shots and the fat shots comes from the club coming too shallow which is often as a result of the setup. Yeah. Okay, so the club is too shallow and often hits the ball can, on the way can up. can be too steep, but it is 99% of the time it's too shallow. Definitely. So this club is sort of hitting on the way up. It either hits the ball halfway up the ball or you get the ground first. So what we need to do there is get the club striking slightly on the downward. So let's go through a setup that's easy to do and it's going to help you do that. Yeah, I mean, so you, can see, you can see by putting the ball back that the people are understanding that they want to hit down on it, but it's just... It throws everybody it's off. It's too extreme. Too extreme. So... Neutral, remember that word neutral. We're going to get Pierce to take a neutral stance with the ball just ahead of the centre. Okay? okay? Take a grip with the shaft neutral again. And all we're going to do from here, this is a simple part, all we're going to do is we're going to lean everything slightly to the left. The shaft will go forward as well, that's fine. One of the key things here now, the shoulders are much more level. And that will allow for this slightly downward strike on the golf ball. So, very easy way there to get a very neutral setup, but it's going to make a big difference. Yeah, yeah without doubt, without doubt. Now, one thing in the golf swing, we're going to give you one thing to think about in the swing. Now, from a bad setup piece, if you go through the bad setup again for yeah. me, ball back, ball back, shoulders tilted. What do we often see from a, a through swing point of view? What do we see people do? I think because the club generally wants to go around the body on the backswing from here, it's going to go out on the way through. Now, the problem with that is, again, that is a shallow through swing, and I'm not getting any rotation at all with my body there. So if you just hold your through swing there for me, Pierce. So what we'll notice from here now is that the chest is still sort of looking over here, and also these shoulders are really, really tilted, so very difficult to make a good contact. Now, if we can show the viewers at home what we want, what do we, what do we want from, yeah, a, from a through neutral. swing, yeah? Okay, so I, th I just feel straight away from my setup, and I stand pretty square on it, I don't open my stance at all. Uh, you can play around with that, but I feel from here, because I'm getting everything leaning towards the left and with a neutral ball position, that the club goes up higher, and then as I swing through, I just turn my body. And I think the turning through of the body in the golf swing, in the chipping swing, is absolutely the most important thing. Definitely. So sure. you can see the different finish positions that again for me. Here's just hold that finish. And as he swings through now, you can see how much the chest is facing that target, okay? His upper body and his hips have turned through. If you can do that, that will help you get that downward strike. So, two things. We've got the setup neutral with a little bit of a lean. And then we've got this chest to turn through and face the target, okay? I think a lot of you guys out there are complicating it with all these things, with ball back, shaft forward, Absolutely. making it very, very hard. So, having said that, Pierce, let's put you to the test. And see, if we, good see how close there. we can get it, but just make a point on this on Pierce of holding that finish position. Absolutely, for us. absolutely. Okay, no problem. So neutral with the ball position. I do like to go slightly forward of centre. Then from there, neutral with the shaft, lean forward, getting those shoulders feeling level, and then from there, club goes up and turn through. And a pretty good oh. shot there. Yeah. So you can see the finish position turning through. Real solid contact. Not too much turf. We don't want too steep. 
It's a slightly downward action. Absolutely. That's really going to help. We don't want divots coming out here. We just want it to be just definitely more brush in the ground. Absolutely. So Anthony, hope that helps for you there. Um, chipping, very important one. Remember the word neutral. We want to get you in a neutral setup and turn that chest through. Guys, hope that helps. Post your comments. How do you chip? If you found a better way, let us know underneath there. And we look forward to seeing you next time on Me and My Golf TV.